yeah, I did. That's all. That's all. Yes, sir. What uh, what, so, what did you say to him? I don't really say anything. It's a lot of stuff in my Yeah. Marquise, how, how important is it to always be ready whatever the numbers call? Uh, it's very important. You know, uh, you can't be negative, but you always have to be positive because you go in the game with a negative uh, state, you get a negative mindset, you know, you start messing up. So, just being positive, uh, celebrating the teammates when they score. Uh, being happy with them, uh, trying to create a good environment on the sideline, uh, just being happy and being safe. Basically, every time your name is called and you make an impact, you play being positive has played a part in that. Oh, yeah, sure, right for sure, for sure. I think that it definitely has played a part in that. Uh, being positive, because I feel like about been out there with a negative mindset, uh, it's just been bad. So I think you know, being positive is uh, key thing to my life. Were you Alex. confident in Matt when he, when he came in the game? Were you confident in what he could do in getting the guys Oh, involved? yeah, I'm confident with um, all our quarterbacks. Uh, this, Next man up, uh, so what now what mentality. So, so what now what? Who yeah. started that? Did the players come up with that? Uh, I think it was Coach KC. Coach okay. KC came up with that. Uh, that's, uh, that's our mentality. So when one guy's go down, the next guy has to be able to do uh, just, just as good as him. Did you walk up to him? Uh, yeah, I definitely did. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, I think anybody was thinking about that. He was in the end zone. He was like right there. I'm like, it would be hard. It's very hard to not go up to him. That's Reggie Bush. I can't put it to work. So. How did you feel to be the finisher? Uh, felt great. Uh, you know, they put me in a situation. Uh, I'm excited to do my job. You've, you've come in late in the last couple of games. During, during kind of the first half of these games, what are you doing or seeing or thinking uh, when you're on the sideline? Uh, just being positive. Uh, when, you know, so Vi helping me out on the sideline, Steven, all the running backs, Coach G, all those guys, you know, just, you know, uh, just helping me stay positive. And my time comes, just take advantage of it. Uh, are you watching kind of what the defense is doing? or how, you know? Oh, yeah, most definitely. In my head, I'm just, like, taking mental breaks, uh, see what I can do, like, thinking about uh, like my assignment, uh, thinking what I would do when I get out there and stuff like that. Is it hard, is it hard to wait, though? Um, not really. When you got two great backs in front of you, um, you know, every competitor wants to be out there. Uh, so I'm like, yeah, it's hard to wait, but also you got to understand, like, you got two great running backs in front of you, so you just, you know, they're doing their thing, so you got to respect them. Did you kind of think that it could happen for you or you didn't play really towards the court, but you think, though, that they're going to maybe need me, you know, they're going to need to run the ball, that'll be my time? Um, no, I was just, you know, uh, that never went through my head. Uh, the opportunity they gave me, I just took advantage of it. Coach thinks of it. Talked this week about you know earning roles on the practice field. Is there one area you think you still have to show on the practice field to kind of get more opportunity? Um, that's something you have to ask Coach Higgins. I can't answer. I'm sorry. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, no